President Polomi Weeks says the boosting of national pride must be a priority. Her comments came at the official opening of the president's house on Tuesday evening. President Weeks said she was aware of concerns expressed about public funds used to restore the building. However, she believes suitable accommodation for holders of high office is important. Then in October, I paid a courtesy call to my counterpart, the Governor General of Jamaica, and my brown eyes turned green with envy as I beheld his stately colonial dwelling. The President's house was refurbished at a cost of $89 million. Prime Minister Dr. Keith Rowley said he was overwhelmed by the restoration of President's house. He lamented there were delays, but said the President's house represents Trinidad and Tobago at its best. Of all those who did believe that it could be done and be done reasonably, and all those who believe that once it was restored, it would restore to the people of Trinidad and Tobago that missing jewel in our crown. This building being, for me, the largest jewel in the crown of the people of Trinidad and Tobago in so far as our legacy is involved. President Weeks, however, will only utilize the residential quarters at President's House for periods in between office hours and official engagements and otherwise as seen fit, but will continue to reside at her private residence.